Thank you, dude. You know, it'd be really helpful, man. Somehow, if I had uh, some help, maybe from man's best friend to do this iguana removal thing, man. Right, go, go. go, boy. So let's be real. Iguanas, they live right next to the water. Most of the time, they jump in. I can't swim after every single iguana. If only I could imagine. Hmm. Use my imagination if I really believe it can happen. If only I can imagine an iguana hunting dog. Yeah. Hmm. There we go. Yes. Here. Oh, look at that. Oh my, God. oh, my goodness. Iguana dog, huh? And look at this. Looks like we have a fine canine right here. Wow, look at him. Whoa, does he have, does he have goggles on? Yeah, sunglasses. Oh, as you guys can see, I don't know how, it's like just like magic, but it looks like we have an iguana hunting dog. But wait, here's this dog's owner. Hey, how are you? What's your name? I'm Lauren. Hey Lauren, nice to meet you. It's Raj the Iguana Man. And who is this guy? This is Rambo. Rambo. Wow. Tell me a little bit about Rambo. He looks uh, very interesting. I've never quite seen a dog like this. He's, he's pretty big. He's a uh, German Shepherd Roddy Pit. He has goggles on for what reason? Does he scuba dive? Uh, yeah, I mean, sure. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> he does. Uh, so when he gets iguanas and he goes in the bushes and stuff, I don't want him getting his eyes scratched up. So, so it kind of protect, uh, protects his cornea. Got you. Protection so he doesn't get scratched or tail whipped from these iguanas. Yep. Because they're going to try to fight or try to escape. Now, Rambo right here, this is not your ordinary canine, I'm assuming. Just by seeing this right here and then looking at this right here, tell me a little bit more more about Rambo. Yeah. So he's actually a medical alert and response service dog for me. Um, so he's been trained for like over two years for hunting, for blood trailing, for uh, sports, for service work, uh, for really anything. He does scent work, a lot of with narcotics. Wow, he seems like quite the canine. Hey, buddy. Oh, wow. <laughs> so you're telling me Rambo has all these skills and potentially he can be an iguana hunting dog. Oh yeah, definitely. Really? Wow, you wanna go hunt iguanas, boy? You want to go with iguanas? Oh, shit. Whoa. There's no iguanas in there. Okay. Well, Rambo seems like he has quite the qualifications, but there's only really one way to tell if he's going to be an iguana hunting dog, or a good one at least. we got to take him training and put him out in the field and see what he can do. We do have a couple jobs lined up, Miss Lauren. We would love to bring you and Rambo out there. All right, Miss Lauren, real quick, I have a little blueprint that I kind of made real quick. It took me a really okay. long time. But I just want to kind of just give you the breakdown of our strategy, okay? Is that a dog? Yeah, we're going to okay. start right here in the land, okay? Uh-huh. And there's going to be iguanas right here on the land, right? Here's the problem. If we try to catch them, they might jump in the water. Okay. And then they're going to go swimming. They might try to escape. But since we have Rambo over here, we might be able to utilize him to either A, grab the iguanas before they go in the water, or... He could possibly even go in the water and try to get them, since he is good at swimming, right? Yeah. And he does have those really nice goggles on. Let me see those goggles. Make friends, Rambo. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Whoa, he's super friendly. Hey. He's just using you to get his goggles off. Oh, is he? <laughs> yeah. Aw, it's okay, buddy. Well, guys, hey, this is the game plan. We're going to try to get these iguanas. Um, yeah, there's no telling what's going to happen. We're not even quite sure if iguanas are going to be out there because it's kind of cloudy. But um, you're pretty confident that Rambo can get the job done, right? Oh, yeah, 100%. All right, touche. Let's go to the job, all right? Let's go, bud. Yeah, three years. I got him at two months old. That's when I started training for him. Oh, there's a couple of them. All right, we, we kind of got a smaller one right here.
Nah, he's over there on the other side. Do you care if he swims? All right. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right, go. Go, go boy. Oh. Oh, wrong way. Wrong way. <laughs> oh. Oh, there he is. All right. Uh, here. He's going for the wrong one, but it's okay. He's in there. Come here, boy. Search. Search. All right, guys. Rambo. He's gonna, he's, right now he's trying to pick up the trail. He's looking for it. He's looking for it. Grab it, grab it. Boy, you're right on it. Look down. Sit. Sit. Sit down. Interesting. Let me go call him back and we'll send him back out there. Interesting. Here. Come here. Here. Sit down. At this point, Rambo is so excited. He's seeing ducks, he's seeing iguanas, he's running, he's swimming, and he can't really pick up the iguana right away. Keep in mind, the iguana was in the water, and that might disrupt his sense of smell. That combination with his sense of excitement is gonna leave this test as a fail. Ultimately, we had to go on the other side to recover that iguana, in the bag. Now it's time for phase two. Go for a bigger, batter, and more alpha iguana. Wait, sit down. Wait. There he is, go get it, boy. There he is, go get it, boy. Go, go, get, go get him, go get him. straight for it, grabbed without any hesitation. Good job, Rambo. That's a good dog. That's me and Rambo's first iguana. In the back. So we just gotta kind of just, uh, like a little bit, just get him used to the scent of iguana. Exactly, yeah. You get a couple on shore like that. Oh, and you put it in his face, he'll oh, he's gonna bite grab it. it. He's gonna grab it. Okay. Yeah, and then he can probably get the one from the water. Okay, good job. Let's go see if we can put another one in the back. First iguana okay. with Rambo. Silly iguana. Here. Ooh, we got one right here. Stop. Leave it. Ooh. We got one right here. Where? Right in front of us. Oh, I don't see it. He's right here. He's a small guy. Oh. Let's see where he goes. Let's see where he goes. All right. Oh, see I see him. Him. You see him over there? Yeah. We'll wait for the other side. I'll finish him and we'll see if we can go grab him, all right? Yeah. Got There he is. Go get him, boy. Go, jump. Go. Go get him. Here. Rambo. Jump. Jump. All right, guys, the iguana is right now flailing around. It's going to be up to Rambo go. to go get that iguana. Rambo. Still flailing. Rambo, look. I'm starting to think in my head, maybe the combination of this iguana is in the water, Rambo being super excited, his first time meeting us, and the iguanas not being big are some factors why Rambo might be having a hard time focusing and tracking these iguanas. Search, Rambo. Search. He's still, he's still right in that area right there. Yeah, he's right over there. We're going to go back there. You see him? You see him more? <laughs> Come here, boy. Rambo. See it. Wait. And of course, this is our first time meeting Rambo, and this is all for practice. Hopefully one day we can take him to a big iguana removal job and get some big iguanas. Nice. 
path. There's no scent. It's underwater. No scent. All right, let me, let, me, let, me, let me get it with a stick, all right? All right. Sit down. There you go, bud. Leave it. You can let him grab it. All right, grab. Here. Bring Good it. Good dog. Good boy. Where are you going? Out. He thinks he's going to eat that grab. iguana. Silly iguana yeah. hunting dog. He doesn't know he has to get these iguanas for us. Come here, buddy. Out. Here. Good boy. Even though Rambo didn't initially get the iguana, he still tried, and I still wanted to reward him by giving the me iguana. And also, to let him know that these iguanas are going to be big and small, they're going to be in the water, so get used to the scent, bud. Keep your eyes and nose open, Rambo. Today's a very overcast day, just FYI. There's not too much going on, but there's enough for us to, you know, do what we got to do. Yeah. Isn't that right, Rambo? Look at him. He's on the trail. To another iguana. Every time we come out here, you see there's always a little effort while we're sweating and fucking enough. Yeah. A little bit of effort. We gotta walk this bank right here, and any iguana on either side, fair game. Rambo, here. Oh, I see one across right there. Oh, yeah, I see it. Go get it, boy. <laughs> Go get it, boy. Stung him. Seriously, go on a removal business out here now. Nah. You silly dog. Hey, he's, that time he was right on the money. Oh yeah, because he's flailing, so he sees it. Good. We gotta, we gotta just, you know, make sure he has all the cues as possible. You yeah. know, visual cues, the movement, this Good and that. Boy. Look at that right there. So out, out here, here. Let's go. Go, boy. Pretty impressive stuff. That's a good iguana hunting Leave dog. it. No. Sit down. This is my iguana. <laughs> no. Silly iguana. And silly iguana hunting dog. Tricks off for kids. We're kind of understanding that we need to get Rambo focused on whatever iguana we're about to take out. So once it's yeah, over, he can go get the recovery. That white pipe. Oh yeah, I see a hole there. There's a hole there, so there's probably a nest over there. But this big tree right here is like their like little kingdom. So what do you do if you find eggs? Oh, uh, <laughs> well. Cook them up. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. As weird as that sounds, yeah, we, you know, believe it or not, the eggs. Some people say it's a delicacy. Oh. Does it taste different than regular eggs? Or? Oh, <laughs> salty. they taste, uh, yeah, I mean, they taste unique, but they taste very, like, very similar and, like, palatable to, like, chicken egg, you know? I mean, I'd imagine once you get past the fact you're eating an iguana egg, it tastes good. Right, 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 right. Yeah, we've had, we had that before. All right, so here's what, that iguana's right there. Here's the issue I have with that shot. He's on that concrete. He's on that pipe right there, so let's say, I don't want to ricochet, you know, because, look, if I bounce it, it could ricochet and the house is right there. So he's got to move on the grass for me to take a safe shot. Let's give him a second. Let's see if he moves up a little. If he does, it's fair game. All right. All right. He sees him. So. Wait, wait. Rambo. Rambo. All right. He did good. He scared him. All right. <laughs> now, let me at least get him back. Okay. Okay. Good job, Rambo. See, Rambo scared the iguana into position now. Now we can take a safe shot. Get him. Okay. Go get it, boy. Get it, boy. Oh. 
That iguana's taking a nice little nap. <laughs> Very long nap. <laughs> Let's see if he's on. Oh, yeah, he's got him. Go, bring him! Bring him! Good boy. He's a good dog. Yeah, that's awesome, man. I'm glad we're doing this now. So yeah. when we get to the big job, you know. He, he's a little better at it. And we can we can all work together. We can make sure he sees it and then all yeah. that stuff. Yeah, exactly. We gotta we gotta learn how to form that that bond, you know. Good boy, Rambo. Here. Good job, Ouse. buddy. Good. Sit down. And I'm guessing Aus means. It's uh go? German for out. Good boy. Sheesh. Iguana did not stand a chance. Blood on your nose. Iguana man in, in Rambo right here, y'all. Putting in some work. And his lovely owner, Lauren, too, man. What an amazing trainer right here. And you do this professionally, too, right? Yeah. Sheesh. Yeah. That's, that's dope, though, man. I, I see you have a lot of passion and a lot of love for it, you know? Oh, yeah. I and, love dogs for it. And, and I see, like, you know, it's, you're good, you know, because you got this guy trained pretty, pretty good. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. All right, buddy. Let's go see if we can get another one, a bigger one. Big alpha you want. Let's get ready, y'all. I'm gonna try to line up on the fence, alright? Alright. Now you gotta be careful because this is very uneven right here, you know? He'll just jump over the fence. For real? Oh yeah. Okay. Boss. Okay. No comment. <laughs> okay. I'm taking my time. Okay, that's on him. Oh, yeah. All right, this is the ultimate test right here, guys. Giant Iguana just got hit with a critical. We're going to see if Rambo can get the recovery and put him in the bag. Okay, it's okay. He smells it. Let him, let him figure it out. <laughs> Search! Nah. Give him a chance. Let him figure it out. He smells it. Grab! There he is. There we go! Yes! yes. Oh, look at that! Oh my, God. Oh my goodness! <laughs> There he is. Wow. Rambo here. Oh shoot, he's got a claw in his eye. Come to drop it. Ow! 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 Oh my goodness. Back boy. Back. Sit down. Still alive. Yeah. Here. Rambo here. 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 Silly iguana. You messed with the wrong iguana hunting dog. Leave it. That's what we came out looking for today. Look at that. I think in the short amount of time we've spent together, I think we've came a very long way. Yeah, definitely from the first one to now. Leave it. Out. Let's go. Out. Silly dog. They never learn. It's okay, buddy. Taste the blood. No, I can't. Can't stop. <laughs> After examining Rambo, he was fine. But in the future, he's definitely going to be wearing his goggles. Miss Lauren, thank you so much for bringing uh, Rambo out here. Of course. I think we had a pretty good uh, little training session. Um, it was a very good transition. You know, we just got to get him more used to it. Um, thoughts, on the, thoughts on our little exercise today? Uh, it was nice, you know. He did good, he learned from it, then it was a good day. Yeah, 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 yeah. I project uh, you know, him uh, being out here a little bit more. Yeah. You guys can, helping out with some removal. We got some big jobs with some big iguanas. Yeah. Right next to the canal, so I think uh, Rambo can definitely uh, help a lot with the team, you know? But uh, as you guys see right here, man, 
Leave it. Sit down. Giant iguana. That Rambo was able to get. So Ultimate big. teamwork right there. Wow. Guys, if you guys enjoyed the video, like, comment, hit the red subscribe button. Let me know your favorite part in the comments down below. Let me know what you guys think of Miss Lauren and Rambo, how they performed out on the field today at this little mock removal job. I think Rambo did really, really well. I can't wait to see what he's gonna do in the future. And if you guys wanna see more of this stuff, also make sure you guys subscribe with the bell notification on so you guys don't miss a beat. Miss Lauren does dog training as well. Do you have your own business or do you work for a um, business or? I have an Instagram. You got an Instagram? That's basically my business, yeah. Really? Yep. And, okay, what's that? Uh, high caliber canines. High caliber canines. We're gonna put that on the screen right here. And we're also gonna drop it in the description down below. If you guys wanna follow Lauren and Rambo, go ahead, check them out. Also, uh, if you guys wanna learn more about potentially training your dog, she's the lady. So go ahead, drop her a message. Let her know the Iguana Man sent you. And guys, we are gonna wrap it up today. Well, we're gonna do a final count, so stay tuned for that. Isn't that right, buddy? That's a good dog. Got a few of them. But we got this big puppy. He was right, right yeah, behind you your house. Huh? Where you got that? Right behind your house. Hey, meet Rambo. He's our new he's our new buddy. He helps us hunt. So if the iguana goes in the water, he swims after him. Yeah. He got all of these for us. So. Yeah. That's good. Pretty impressive, right? Yeah, we haven't been here in a while. We're gonna when summer's coming up, we're gonna be out here more. Maybe I see this is like the small ones. Yeah, there's a lot of small, but you know, when it gets hot, more big ones will come out. Yeah, yeah. We'll be out here. Okay. All right. We finished the day with six iguanas. Me, Lauren, Rambo really had fun in this training exercise. I hope you did too. Really goes to show the bond between man and dog. Truly man's best friend. Like this video, let me know what you think in the comments. Hope you enjoyed. And stay tuned for the next episode.